here. So today we are working on your thighs. All these exercises are probably going to make you start shaking. Um, and if they do, congratulations to me and to all of us because that means that you are working super duper hard. Now don't be afraid when your body does that. It's just doing something that it's not used to and that's awesome because I'm introducing a bunch of new moves in this workout. So you've been with me for a while. This is really going to shake things up. And if you've never done a workout with me before, well, welcome to the wrath of Blogilates. Okay. So roll out your mat or just lay on your carpet and let's go ahead and get started. Okay guys. So I want you to lay down on your side. Our first move is called triangle thighs. So check it out. I'm going to place my elbow right underneath my shoulder. If this is a little bit too propped for you, feel free to hold onto your head here or even lay it all the way down. I don't really care what's going on here as long as you're not like hunched over. Okay. So just make sure you're aligned. Now my pinky toe is pressing into the floor. What I'm going to do is tap my big toe from the top foot in the front, lift up and come right behind it, behind the mat. Okay. That will be triangle thighs. Let's go ahead and get started and then we'll make sure to switch later on. Okay. Ready? A three, two, one. It's a lift and down. A lift and down. Very good. Up. Good. Very nice, guys. Lift. I want you to squeeze your leg, keeping everything nice and tight. Lift and down. And up. You got it. Boom. So good, guys. In front of the mat and behind the mat. Let's go up and down. Now you're also working your booty here. Good. Lift. Ooh, nice. This is just a little warm up. This ain't nothing. Okay. Clamshells right here. Knees in, out, and in. Notice how my ankles are touching. My heels are together. My knees open out. Now you start really feeling those thighs and that booty. Good. And it's okay to change up the position here but I want you to focus, squeezing your butt cheek every time you come back. Squeeze, you got it. Boom, nice and precise what you are. Good stuff. Okay, now press, press. Uh oh, do you feel it? I do, uh-huh. And I like my pulses. Let's go, boom, boom. Okay, you think this hurts? I'm gonna change it up, extend it. Close the knees, lift yourself up. Okay, this is optional, but I want you to try. So, lift and close. Ooh, crazy. Hand on the hip. You got it, let's go. Now you're really feeling that bottom booty as well as the outer thigh. Let's go, up and down. Woo! Come on, push. Okay guys. I'm gonna switch up one more time. Now, extend this leg. Lift, uh oh, yep, you got it. That is thigh and booty at the same time, the whole lower body. And I feel a little shoulder too. It's like a triple whammy move. You got it, lift and lift. Come on, you got this. Don't give up, I know it hurts. You got this, four, three, Two and one. Bring it back. Two triangles. Back and front. Good. So see, these triangles feel like nothing compared to uh, the other moves, right? <laughs> so appreciate it. Boom and up. But that's why I really want you to push yourself. Okay. Up, down, and lift. Perfect. Up. Yep. Yeah. You got it. Squeezing the quads. Pointing the toes, even my lower leg is activated the entire time. Down, up, yep, come on. Breathing, boom, lift. You're doing so good. I'm so proud of you for working out with me today. Almost there, down, lift. Strong guys, strong guys, keeping the pelvis facing me. Good and down, yes. Okay, strong thigh, strong butt, and we're gonna flip over onto the other side to even it out, because how tragic would it be if one side was all like blonk, blonk, and the other side was like so much. Okay, we're starting out with triangle thighs. You know this. Three, two, one. Lift, down, up. Yes. Perfect. You 
You got it. And lift. And lower. High. Yes, let's kick it up. You and your rocket. Come on. Lift. Lower. Up. Down. Yes, guys. Keeping that pelvis forward. Don't let your butt rotate back. You're doing so good. Yeah, so good. Come on. Woo. Let's go. Four. And three. Nice. Two. Okay, clamshells. Here it is. Open and close. Sticking your heels together. Opening up your knee. Keeping that pelvis forward. I want you to squeeze your butt. Squeeze it. Now it doesn't need to open that big. Okay, it's a little mini baby clam. But if you're squeezing right at top, really gonna feel your thighs and your glutes. Yeah. Come on, keep everything activated. You're doing so good. Okay, eight more. And then we're gonna elevate. I know you got this. Don't be afraid. That is okay to be afraid too. As long as you keep going and you give it a shot, even if you fall, it's like five inches on the ground, okay? Now lift yourself up. Open and close. Oh, yep, you feel it. Yeah, come on. Open and lift. Yep, notice how I'm also pushing with my obliques off the mat. Good stuff. Four more. Four, a three, a two. Okay, guys, extend that leg. We lift and lower. Oh my gosh, everything is activating. Point your toes now. Long leg. You want to work those thighs? Then give me the best form you've got. Up and down. Do not give up. Because you're going to be eight. Eight. Whew. Seven. Count with me. Six. Uh huh. Can't hear you. There we go. Let's go. Four. Three. You're shaking me too. One more. One, bring it down, okay. Triangle, thighs, boom, and up, low, and lift, down. Woo, do you feel it? Come on, down, and lift, low, and lift, stay strong, down. Okay guys, I want you to focus. Really put all the energy in the lower body. Feel free to rest your head if you need to, okay? Down, and up, and down. Okay, give me a couple more. One more just for safety. Lift it and bring it down. Okay, really good. Now, we are on our back. I'm gonna go into pointed sideways scissors. Now this is a new one. Let's go through regular sideways scissors first. If you feel like you have a bigger booty or you feel like your low back can never touch the ground, place your hands in a triangle and place it underneath your butt, okay? I want you to lift your legs up just like so. Notice how my low back automatically presses into the mat. Sideways scissors ask you to open the legs out, cross the mat top. This is really gonna activate those thighs, inner and outer, okay? So, out, in, out, boom, you got it. Out, nice, and boom, good. Four more, let's go, it's four, and three, nice, two, and one. Okay, check it out guys, I want you to point and flex and point and flex as we bring the legs out. Now bring it up, it's a point and flex, point and flex. Notice how you have to really engage your entire leg to make this work. Good. Boom. Nice. Really point. Now I'm still working on my point. I'm so jealous of the ballerinas and all you dancers who can super point your legs. I'm practicing. I even have like this little ballet stretcher thingy. Um, my goal is to be able to point my toes really nicely and make you proud. It's my little obsession. <laughs> Come on, let's go. Boom. Good. Now, I'm really squeezing from 
my quads here, okay? It's not just about the ankle or the foot, it's the entire leg that's being activated. Good, place my hands underneath. Good, stop. Okay, good. Now scissors, out and in, and out and in. Now make sure this isn't going into your hip flexors at all, and placing the hands behind your tailbone is definitely going to help with that, okay? That takes all the work and puts into the thighs and the abs. Out and in. Pointing your legs, don't get tired. Almost there. Let's go, let's go. Doing so good. Let's work those thighs. Yes. Point the toes. So close. Out and in. Whew. Nice, guys. Now, I really want you to think about this challenge. It's not even physical, it's mental. So, if you tell yourself you can get through this, you will. Let's go. Come on. Bring it out. And in. Are you shaking? I am. Let's go. Stay strong now. I want you to point through your entire leg. Abs tight. Relaxing your shoulders. Very good. Bring it out. Hold. Flex the feet and squeeze them back in. Bring the knees into the chest and give them a big hug. Oh my gosh. Point. Flex. Point. Legs and bring the heels together. Let's go into a nice butterfly position to open up those hip flexors in case you did use them a little bit. Oh, just lay there. That feels so good. Inhale through your nose. Exhale through your mouth. Lengthen those legs all the way out. Hands long above the head. Inhale. Big exhale and slowly peel your spine off the mat. Lifting, lifting, lifting. Bring the hands down. Guys, you did such a fantastic job. I'm so excited that we finished that because that was kind of hard. Okay, let me know in the comments below how you felt and also let all the other popsters know which move they should be warned about. And also, give this video a thumbs up and share it with a friend because every time you guys share Blog Pilates and Pop Pilates workouts, it helps grow our community and that is the most priceless, amazing thing you could ever do. Um, so thank you so much if you've already shared and I will see you in our next workout. Bye. Whoa.